Hey, shut up and listen to me. I'm Dr. Dan and I want you feeling better. How the hell do you do that? Will you stop drinking this crap or eating this crap? That's how. <coughs> now shut up. Listen for a second, all right? God, you're going to need meat and a hell of a whole lot of it. That's why Meetabrix might be the one for you. Heck, it probably is and you don't know it because you're too busy listening to doctors. We take every kind of meat available and shove it all in a blender. Then the oozy meat juice is injected with fine cheese solution. We don't stop there. I bet you wish we did. The meat is dipped in nine kinds of chocolate brewed from the far regions of Africa. Probably. I don't know and I don't care. Pay attention and listen to this witness testimony, why don't you? I dare you. I took me to Brexa Bricks and instantly got diabetes and 40 different parasites, but wow, do I feel like a million bucks. Well, there you have it. That's all you need. Don't do your own research on this because that's what Satan wants you to believe. What are you, a sucker? Sucker for Satan? Me to Bricks. Get it now or get sicker. What are you waiting for? Your grandma to die? Call now. This is to give us a uh, hardwired connection in the RV while we do stream testing for the new RV studio. It's got like a 100 foot Ethernet cable. And um, hopefully this is the setup we'll have when we go on the road, but we're also getting bonded cellular network uh, set up in here today so that we'll be able to do it from anywhere. This is the old school TimCast set. Uh, this is where Tim recorded IRL before they moved into the new studio, starting a new podcast. Um, it's pop culture and politics, or at least where pop culture and politics kind of intersect. Tim gets into it on some stuff where he talks about celebrities and things like that, but we're gonna go more in depth. And basically right now we're doing test shows and kind of watching them back to see what we like, what we don't like. We're going to be decorating. We want it to feel different than what IRL felt like when we were recording in here, when they were recording in here. So yeah, that's what uh, that's what I'm working on here. That's what Miracle's working on in, in addition to being your uh, friendly neighborhood uh, customer service rep. Now this part's gonna be relatively easy. You guys wanna scuttle him? Hey, you got get get him out, get him out, get out, get out, get out, get out of here. Can you lift the metal? Yeah. Hey, look at that. 
Come on, Roberto. Come here, come here, come here. Here, yeah, no, let's watch this. Yeah, kicking your legs. <laughs> come down. Look at the food. Look at the food. Look at his eggs, look at the kindle. There you go, see? Yeah, they might need to be cut. It's fine. Huh? It's not gonna pour out enough. Yeah. Maybe we'll, we'll have to open it up a little bit. This is the new 5G bonded cell network right here. So we've got uh, four SIM cards, um, two of each from two different providers. Um, and this is actually, well, ideally this is going to be um, a failover network that we're going to use um, if uh, our wired ethernet goes down because hopefully we'll have wired ethernet wherever we are. We can't guarantee that so this will be sufficient um, theoretically if, uh, if we don't have um, a place to get wired ethernet from. But uh, if this is plugged in here in the WAN port, um, if somebody kicks the cable or if um, you know their network goes down, it will automatically switch over to the bonded cell and it's basically taking four different 5G connections, just like your cell phone, and um, splitting up all the packets between them and sending them over four separate connections and then tying them back together on the other side. Um, so, yeah, I'm pretty excited about this. Uh, I've done some testing and the speeds look uh, like they should work. Um, so I'm pretty happy with West Networks for setting this up for us. Did you see the antenna um, goes up? So these are the cables for the antenna. There's four channels for each antenna, and there's four antennas, so 16 cables going up this way. And then uh, little holes in the roof there. There's four little bumps up there, the antennas. And uh, preliminary tests are looking promising, so things are checking away. The female black stars, even the male black stars, ooh, sorry. If you look at them in the sunlight, they're not really black. I don't know if the other barred rock is the same way, but if you like look at him, you can see uh, the sunlight reflects in a weird way. It's like blue, hologrammy, and then same with the females, except they're all like, wow, this one's so purple right now. It's just the angle you have to look at them on. It's like a peacock almost. Look at that. So this is where Lydia is going to sit. Um, we've got the uh, mixing board over here for the audio, which is going to go out to the um, four or five mics over here in the uh, seating area. You're going to have one guest right here in front of me. You're going to have one over there in that corner and one on the right corner. And um, so this way you'll have these four cameras. Um, one is going to be pointed here, one is there, one is there. 
and one's pointed at me, the producer. Um, and we'll have like the TV over there, which uh, pops up and down, which is going to be able to show the um, whatever the uh, you know relevant article of the day is. That's kind of nifty. Um, so yeah, we'll probably Tim over here, Ian over here, guest over there, something like that. And um, Tim's gonna have his little keyboard and monitors seated right here. Um, what else? So these arms, I have to figure out a way to uh, mount. Like these ones here, there's a little ledge I can use. But I think I'm gonna have to find some like L-shaped brackets to put on the walls here because there's really nowhere to like put these on. Even with this table, there's not enough space. You see the little cameras on the on the wall. These things seem uh, like okay quality with high enough light. I think once we get the lights installed, we're gonna have like. One, two, three, four, five, probably, of those um, LED bar lights. And uh, once we get those installed, we'll see if these little cameras are going to be good enough quality for the show. Um, otherwise, we might have to swap them out. One more work ahead of me. What's up, chickens? Hey, buddy, come here. I'm gonna move Roberto. You can't. Can you give me a hand? You can't. You just told me to. I didn't tell you to do it just now. Well, you said yesterday to do Dorothy it. Dorothy still. You gotta, you gotta move Dorothy and then Roberto. Or... Why? Dorothy's almost dead. Oh, wow. Yeah. Where is she? Oh, okay. Can you give me a hand? No. I mean, I don't wanna hurt these guys. Much of a, Why don't we just put the collar on him, dude? Well, definitely we're gonna do that. And then we'll leave him there. I mean, I'm trying to rest, dude. I got, I'm on antibiotics. You're not gonna hear him with the collar. Or at least we'll try the collar first. We can't take the one rooster out of the fucking coop. Yeah, we don't need a rooster. Yeah, we do. Here, we bought six chickens. One of them was Miss Jenny. And we were gonna have them just in that thing, and now we got Chicken City, and we need. We, we, we were actually trying to get a rooster. Not, not initially, but we were trying to get a rooster afterwards, and then we got lucky and it turned out he was a rooster. We not have a rooster on a farm. We have five. I know. I mean, we'll, try, we'll try the collar out, and if it doesn't work right away, then we'll move we'll, 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 we'll. I got rooster chokers. They're coming tomorrow. And you put them what around the rooster. Where are the collars getting here? Uh-huh. Where are the collars getting here? I think they're here tomorrow. Put them around their neck and tighten it, and then when they crow, you can't hear it. And that's really all it comes down to is the noise. This is my room. This is my bedroom room. And did you successfully uh, choke the chicken? No, I'll be choking it tomorrow. 